Things are going to be okay. And that's just what I th tell myself every day. Okay. Bye. Hello, everyone. Today is March 28th. As the title itself say, we're going to be unboxing this bad boy right here. I got this from the store called Boston. Pretty sure that's how you pronounce it because otherwise I don't know. I was so happy that I found their store because they legit sell like everything that has to do with milk tea. So yeah, we're gonna unbox this thing. It's a pretty big box. From what I can remember, I only ordered like four stuff. And for some reason, when the box arrived, I was so scared because I was like, that's a huge box. Don't tell me those four little things that I thought are gonna be little things are gigantic versions of milk tea. But they're pretty cheap, so it didn't really bother me. What was expensive was their shipping. It was like 20 bucks. Girl, 20 plus for shipping. get the obvious one first. Oh my gosh, this is a huge one. Okay, so this is the milky powder mix. And look at the packaging. The packaging is pretty. Very um low-key cute. Not very vava voomish, but you know what I mean? This thing right here costs, if I'm not mistaken, $10.95. So it is pretty cheap. Like, look at that. It's a big, big mix. It's got 2.2 pounds in it. It's got instructions as well on how to blend your own milk tea. So that is a plus to me. That's why I was so comfortable buying their stuff because on each product they have, they have instructions on how to make milk tea out of it, whether that's mocha flavor, lychee, strawberry, banana, whatever. They always have instructions on how to make that powder into a milk tea. So that's a plus. The next one. This one is, oh yeah. Yep. Yep. I didn't realize that it was this big. <laughs> so noisy. <laughs> It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. I'm trying to keep Olivia asleep. This one, $15. This is so heavy, y'all. 8.38 pounds. I thought I was gonna get like a, you know, like a, like this big. <laughs> but this is what I got. What am I gonna do with this? These are all product of Taiwan and if you don't know, just in case, I know I'm sure from the bottom of my heart, milk tea started in Taiwan. I know I read that once. I'm pretty sure. I know it started in Taiwan. This one right here is like a star version nata de coco uh, with like a lychee flavor, which is my favorite. And yeah, I'm obsessed with nata de coco ever since I was a kid. It would have this nata de coco that comes in like pink, violet, blue, red, and green. And it's so good. Our parents would always like scare us that, oh, if you're gonna eat nata de coco, it's gonna get stuck in your lungs and it's gonna stay there forever. It, that used to scare the shit out of me. So I would not buy nata de coco, but there would be times where I really want it. So I would buy and sneak out. But then once I'm like eating it and chewing it, I'm like thinking, oh my gosh, these things are gonna get stuck in my lungs. <laughs> Okay, so next one, this thing right here, it's an iced mocha milk tea powder. Um, and this one right here is my favorite milk tea flavor. That's the only, only thing that I get other than the usual milk tea flavor. And I paired this with, get ready. coffee jelly. I'm obsessed with this one. That is what I get from my local milk tea store. A mocha milk tea with coffee jelly. Sometimes I add the tapioca balls. It depends on my mood, but most of the time it's just nata. Once my besties see this video, they're gonna be like texting me, hey, give me some of that jelly. Give me some of that. Well, Yun lang, wala akong choice kundi bigyan sila. 
I don't mind buying these if it tastes really, really good. I don't mind paying the $20 shipping. Other than these, I bought an instant oolong tea because you still have to mix a cup of tea along with the powder if you're gonna make yourself a milk tea because this is basically just like, almost like a creamer. You still have to make your own tea, brew your own tea. So I don't have time for that. If I want milk tea, I want milk tea in five minutes. I don't have time to brew my own tea for like 20 minutes. So I bought an instant oolong tea and I bought some instant tapioca balls as well just in case that takes only like five minutes to cook. This is the instant tapioca balls that I got, which takes like only five minutes to cook. This one is the instant oolong tea. So yeah, that's, that's my milk tea haul. Let's take a picture. These things does not need refrigeration. That's a good thing. So I really just got to keep it in a cool and dry place. And that's just, that's amazing. But yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, even though it's pretty useless. I'm actually feeling like coffee right now. I've been so obsessed with coffee lately that I always want to drink iced coffee. And so one time I went to Walmart and... I came across the Starbucks Frappuccino chilled coffee drink. And of course, it's in mocha. Pregnancy cravings is freaking real. It's unbelievably uncontrollable. I really want one right now, but I am planning on making myself a mango smoothie today. And that's the only thing that I should take today. This pregnancy has been really, really tough for me, but yeah. But yeah, Olivia's sleeping and I'm gonna just do stuff around the house. And thank you guys again so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you on my next video.